In this training, I'm gonna share with you a couple resources that I've recently found, which help you find different checklists on the internet for all sorts of different topics. They also allow you to create your own checklists. Now, what I think would be a very useful strategy is to grab someone else's checklist and then put it into Conversion AI and have Conversion AI improve it, make it better, and expand on the checklist because that way you basically have the outline of a book or a product from someone else's effort of putting together this checklist and then you're expanding on it with the tool. You can even rewrite uh, the checklist so you're not worried about any sort of copyright infringement. But this is a fantastic way for you to turn out content incredibly fast that people have put a lot of effort and time into creating. So like this this uh, example checklist has been viewed uh, you know, 5,731 times. It's all about freelance blogging, okay? So what I can do is I could just copy that information. I can go into the long form assistant here. Uh, freelance blogging. Okay. And we'll go with freelance blogging as our keyword. And we can. I don't think I saved my keyword freelance blogging. There we go. So I'll generate ideas. So this is from the site checkly.com, uh, L-I. And then uh, this other site I found is checklist.com. And they're both very similar. Like this one, um, this particular one is about a moving checklist. And so you could just copy and paste that whole thing, drop it into Conversion AI, and make your own version of it. So I'm just going to grab that title. I'll have it generate an idea. So it's going to just kind of do an intro paragraph here. Use it, open editor. Cool. All right, now I'm going to paste that whole thing in there. I don't need that image. Oops. I think you get the idea. So, you know what? I will, if I can paste it without the formatting. There we go. Now I don't have all those bullets. All right, so I could turn these into headings if I wanted. I'll put length long, composed. So what I'm going to do is three asterisks here. Let's try that. That may work better. And I'll have it start like it's finishing a sentence here. Let's try doing a few things here. So I'm going to highlight that. I'm going to change it. I'll try composing again. Now oh, we're just getting questions. Interesting. I may have to think a little bit more on this. Select an approved keyword from the list of approved keywords. Let's try putting it as like step one. It does for step two.
You know what? I think the freelance blogging thing is kind of messing it up. <laughs> Notice how I deleted everything? Let's see what happens now. That's right, conversion AI. There's always a workaround. Let's see what you do now, since you have nothing to base it off of. Interesting, it still seems to know that it's blogging. So what I'm gonna do, just copy my keywords again. I'm gonna do new, and boom, and continue. Boom. Yeah, that's the one I want, blank. Aha. Yeah, nothing. Open editor. That's right. You don't know what I want you to do now. All right, let's see what it does, because this is kind of fun. Uh, it has nothing to go off of. There we go. That might have... Uh, that looks like it's doing a better job of giving an example for that uh, thing. So now what I'm going to do is well, these asterisks will make it so it doesn't go above. It doesn't look at anything above it. And I'll go with long here. And that's basically walking through how you'd want to fact check this, but it's basically walking through how to create a blog post. Then I'll do the asterisks again. This is how you would want to do this. Yeah. yeah, this is how I would do it. And that way you could create your own expanded article based off of a popular checklist that someone else wrote. Um, I would probably take these particular um, headings and rewrite them. So maybe uh, either uh, rephrase would be one way to do it, or explain it to a fifth grader, or kind of going back and forth until you find an, a nice mix uh, for yourself, just so you would pass any sort of plagiarism. Uh, you're just taking the general outline idea, uh, from the checklist, but you're totally making it your own, and then you're using Conversion AI to expand on the information. You could also write some of this information yourself and then put in your own pictures or video clips, but that would be a fantastic way to churn out a an article for something very quickly on a topic that you don't really know a whole lot about because someone else has taken the time crafting this checklist, and then you're able to turn that into a blog post. You could record it as a video, you could extract the video content, and that could be like an mp3, so you could have a podcast, you could all, do all sorts of stuff to repurpose this information or sell it as as your own course or, an e or a book, all sorts of stuff that you can do with this. So it's a really powerful way to get a lot of writing done in a short amount of time just by doing a few simple tweaks. I really think uh, starting your article off where it has no information, I just put in a space, so it had nothing to go off of in a conversion AI, and then it just looked at my uh, beginning header here. Uh, that was, I think, the most efficient way to, to do this uh, because it didn't have anything to go off of. And that was a great way for the tool to just focus on this particular sentence and expand on it. It wasn't getting confused with other information. So that's a, a little trick that we figured out just by making this video. So I hope you found this useful. I hope this is a, a great way for you to create a lot of content really fast by uh, implementing checklists that other people have put together and making your own version of it with Conversion AI and expanding on it so you can create massive articles, massive blog posts, video content, could be a script for whatever you want to do just by uh, combining this all together. So let me know if this is useful for you, for you. Just leave a comment below. I look forward to hearing from you and I look forward to growing your business with tools like Conversion AI.